Welcome to the podcast. You're listening to the Team Olenek Podcast Experience, all things real estate. And we're going to go over real estate market values in Winnipeg, Manitoba. We'll be covering neighborhoods of River Park, South Dakota Crossing and South, Land, uh, South Glen together. Then we will head over into Royalwood. We'll be in Royalwood, we'll be standalone. After that, we'll be doing Island Lakes and, and uh, Bonavista. From there, we'll hop over to Windsor Park, Niagara Park, Waterside Estates. Then we'll go to Southdale and Niagara Place. We'll finish up in Sage Creek and Southland Park. So currently River Park, South Dakota Crossing and South Glen, eight residential detached homes on the market. Three came to market in the last seven days, zero new builds, four are pending sale, one has sold. And uh, sorry, I'm wrong on that. Four pending sale and three have sold. So only leaving you one home on the market right now. And uh, we're seeing a little bit of a shift in the market again. We were going in the direction where inventory levels were climbing a bit. We weren't seeing as many multiple offers. We were seeing some stuff selling below asking. Uh, that's not the case. It's all out the window again. Inventory levels are really down in the past week. Um, with eight homes on the market in an area this large and seven of them selling, you guessed it, the three that, uh, three that sold, all sold above asking. And I'm sure the four that are pending will be right up there too as well. Um, let's hop over into Royalwood now. Four on the market, two came to market in the last seven days. One's currently pending, two sold. So three quarters of the inventory is gone and uh, one sold above asking. The other one just slightly below asking. Royalwood has been performing less than other neighborhoods. Uh, still been very good, but less than other neighborhoods. Other neighborhoods have been incredible. So very good to incredible. There's your difference. Um, Let's talk about Island Lakes and Bonavista. Eight residential homes on the market there. Four came to market in the last seven days. One's a new build. One's currently pending sale and four have sold. And like other neighborhood, all four that sold above asking price. So if you're curious of what your home might be worth or houses might be worth in a neighborhood, we can do a customized report on your house specifically or houses specifically in neighborhoods and give you an accurate value of what they would be worth. Um, Winter Park, Niagara Park, and Waterside Estates. Inventory levels aren't quite as low there, but they are lower than they have been. Um, 17 residential houses on the market. Seven came to market in the last seven, or four came to market in the last seven days, sorry. Zero new builds, zero pending, and four that sold, three above asking, one just slightly below asking there. If you're thinking about selling your house, want to get above asking, reduce the stress levels, just look at our Google reviews. You'll see we're the team that reduces the stress levels. Um, if we look at Southdale and Niagara Place, there are currently nine on the market. Four came to market in the last seven days. Zero new builds. One's currently pending. Two have sold. Both have sold above asking price. Sage Creek, Southland Park, um, 19 homes on the market there. Two came to market in the last seven days. Eight are new builds. Three homes are currently pending. Two are sold. Both that sold, sold above asking price. So that's the trend for this past seven days. Less inventory in the market, houses selling above asking price. And uh, yeah, that's the direction we're heading again right now. We'll see what next uh, week brings. Um, if you're thinking about selling, again, like I said, never been a great time to, never been a better time to sell. Um, getting top dollar out of them. And we've got some fantastic systems in place that make sure you get top dollar. Because I am seeing some great homes not get top dollar like they should be. Thanks for watching. If you have any real estate related questions, reach out. Other than that, we'll talk to you again tomorrow and we will be out in rural Manitoba doing real estate market reports. Thank you.